Why, hello there, stranger. I don't think I've seen you around these parts before. Uh, what's with the ghetto? What do you mean, what planet you're on? I mean, you're on Earth. Where on Earth? Well, I'm not that good at the whole uh, map stuff, but uh, you're on my farm. Pleasure to meet you. My name's Cletus. What year is it? I mean, it's only... 2024? What? What are you- what- what are you talking about? What? What in God's name are you talking about? Galactic Federation? Hun, we barely made it to the moon. And what's that thing on your arm? Uh, is that a shield made out of lightning? Good God, what the hell are you? Huh. Well, I don't know where you came from. I don't know where you're going. As long as you don't hurt me or my animals, I'll be fine. Oh, your little doohickey's not working. Come on now, come inside. I might as well get you something to eat. You can take off the helmet. I, I assume you're human, right? Uh-huh. Well, you're on Earth, you can breathe. We kind of live here. Uh, oh, damn. Oh, soldier. Should I call you soldier or cyborg? That's a lot of metal. I don't think I've seen that much metal since I got my cousin pissed. <sighs> well. Make yourself a home. There's some pies in the oven. Don't worry, don't worry, nothing will burn. I'm gonna go harvest some crops. It'll only take me about a, a minute or two. I know the field's massive, but I mean, I got this hoe over here. And it can do an amazing job. I don't even have to break a sweat. Oh, and if someone comes knocking that has a blonde hair, blue eyes, uh, don't talk to them, they're mine. I'm warning you, I get mighty possessive with the ones I love. But, if it's anyone else, uh, feel free to chat them up. Uh, they like, um, they like eggs. I, I don't know why exactly, but... It appears that every time I give them eggs, they seem to like me more. I mean, I know everybody likes free stuff, but... I never expected it to be that much, but... You don't see me complaining. Hmm? Oh yeah, that's the map of the dungeon. Yeah, yeah. There's a mine off in town, and uh... Every so often I go inside, I, I try to get as deep as I can go, and then there's a dungeon over there. There's some creepy crawlies, a lot of bugs, a couple slime monsters too. Undead soldiers and skeletons too, it's uh... Makes me wonder what was uh, actually going on down there, but I... I'm too chicken to actually stay there for very long. I, I get my gemstones and I get out of there. A video game.
You mean like on those uh, Xboxes or uh, computers or whatever? Well, the best I got was a high score of a thousand on Pac-Man, and uh, it's not that impressive. And it's been years. I probably, probably won't even get to that high. Why, why, why the, why bring it up though? A crossover? What does that mean? Is that some kind of sports move? Oh, it's when uh, two things merge. You know, ah, oh, like, like, uh, like how we made the uh, lemons. You know, like we took some of one fruit and some of another fruit and we kind of just smushed them together and over some time it became a something else. Something like that? Alright, alright. Well, y'all thinking that it's a crossover thing. My farming thing and your space soldiery thing. I mean, uh, you did just appear from out of nowhere with the sound of trumpets accompanying you. Did you hear that, by the way? Trumpets. No? Just me? All right. You know, that, that would explain quite a few things, actually. Oh, heavens, yes. There was a... There was an angel over here flying around yesterday saying, uh... Saying they needed to find their goddess or whatever. And I was like, hey, what's the goddess's name? And then I never heard of him before. Um... There was this talking tiger... Thing. It, it could only really say one thing, and it was, uh... It just called itself a, a wrestler of some kind, and it kind of, it, it breathed fire. Yeah, it was weird. It could breathe fire and do wrestler moves, and was standing on its two feet. It was, it was odd. Oh, and there was this one kid with a really big head. Like, disproportionately, like, they were clearly a child. They were clearly, like... 12 or something years old, but they were as tall as me, and they had the proportions of a, of a, of a llama being on a brat stall. But, 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 don't tell him I said that. The kid can make explosions with his mind, I don't now want to, I don't now want to mess with him. Oh, and just the other day, there was this cube guy. I don't know what else to describe him. He was just square. Very, very, very square and rectangular and not a curve on his body. Oh, and there was this group of people like last month that were, uh, well, you, you, you'd see their tap in like Lord of the Rings and stuff. One had Gandalf beat for longest beard. Yeah. I said, I said hello and uh, I gave him some food and they thanked me by dropping this entire bag of gold coins. I, I, I don't know where they got it from, but hey, I, I, I guess. And then the wizard looking guy wrote some things in the dirt and then they were gone. Like magic. I mean, probably is magic. I don't know what's happening anymore. But, 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 tomorrow I did hear that Angel Face is kind of come back for a visit. They were quite confused as well. Probably a little sad that they can't find their goddess right now, so maybe if you can uh, let them know what's happening here, and if we can gather up everyone maybe we can uh, find a way to get everyone back home wouldn't that be nice 
I, I, I don't think I can uh, charge you a little doohickey, by the way. Uh, I don't think it plugs in anything. Right, right. 